In this tutorial we'll be learning about aligning and cropping photos in Photobook Designer. First we'll choose our template from the list below. Now I've got four portrait photos and two landscape and as you'll see my photos are older scanned photos and they're all different shapes. I'm going to try and choose some shapes that are relatively close to what is in the templates and then we will crop these so that they all have the same aspect ratio. That's a cute one. And my last photo. Now we'll begin with cropping the photos first. I'm going to double click here and then we'll just take this and choose landscape and position it to where I like. Double click I've auto corrected the colors, click OK, double click again and then choose landscape again, position the photos the way I like it, I can choose OK or just double click. Now this one here is um, portrait so we need to choose a portrait shape, click OK again a portrait shape you could choose square or whatever free style but we need portraits so that they have the exact same aspect ratio and repeat and then we will do our last photo and I'll show you some other tools in here as well so we crop to portrait and then adjust and then I can do auto levels which is auto correct image and then I could brighten or darken the image increase contrast decrease contrast or increase color which in this case you can't because it's grayscale and now I'm just dragging and dropping over the top of these images and selecting aligned to the bottom. I need to make sure this photo is the same size as the other one first and then I will drag a box around the outside and choose align objects, align to top and remember you can stop any time with this video and try it yourself at home. Now I'm going to do the slow way first here. I could just align that by using the arrow keys and moving it by using the arrow keys on my keyboard or I can move that photo out the way put the bounding box around the outside and align it to the right uh, yes the right hand side now I'm going to do the same to the other side so move this photo out the way and put your bounding box page align multiple objects to the left was pretty much there already now I'll just adjust my photo so they're basically separated pretty evenly and then I will drag a bounding box around the outside snap to choose page align objects to the bottom now they're all perfectly aligned up and I can go page and add a border so you can now see that they are lined up nicely however we have forgotten to change the size of the photo so I'm just aligning it to the bottom dragging it to the top so it's the same size and using my arrow key on my keyboard to gently move it across so it's still aligned at the bottom if I was worried I could do an alignment again that white strip down there right hand side of that photo will not print you can do a preview to see what will actually print Please don't feel like you're alone if you need help. You can contact us via phone or email from our contacts page or watch further tutorials. Thanks for watching and have fun making your photo books.